Who in the hell are you people, and why were my staff and I brought here against our will? Where are we? The who and the where don't matter. It's the why that is of concern. Dr. Bailey, I'm Agent Lawless. You and your team have been brought in to manage this man's condition. And what exactly is his condition? He's sedated for now. We need that sedation to last, indefinitely. He was a deep cover agent for years. The information in this man's head is a great risk to national security. What exactly are you asking of us? Your job here is quite simple, Dr. Bailey. Keep this man in a chemically induced coma until given further instructions for myself and myself only. You're asking me to keep this man in an indefinite coma? I'm not asking. The situation is this. You do as you're told, or I will have any record of this conversation ever happening erased by any means necessary, and then find a doctor that knows how to follow instructions. Of course, none of this can leave this room. I'm not happy about this, not at all, but it seems I have no choice but to comply. I hope for your sake, you stay true to your word, Agent. Don't make this any harder than it has to be, or you won't be the only one throwing threats around. I am a doctor, Agent. I know how to hide medical evidence. Nurses, you heard the man. Let's set up. Nurse Ferrana, set up a 15 milligram drip of propofol over a 12 hour period, and then repeat that dose every 18 hours. But Dr. Bailey, at that dose, he'll never wake up. I'm very aware of that, nurse. Just follow my damn orders. Fielding, monitor their every move, especially Dr. Bailey. We can't afford to screw up again. This man must stay comatose.